Hello, beautiful people. Thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Demachele, your Gap to Go with Contagious Energies. I hope you guys are doing great and you guys are doing good. You already know that this channel is all about sex and relationship, blending families, and a whole lot more. If you're interested in this type of content, please do consider subscribing below, turning on a notification bell so that you are notified every time I post a video. I posted a video uh, about how to tighten your vagina and I had shared like different type of methods that I use and methods that I've heard from other people that I had not tried, but believe me, me, I tried every single one of them and the results are amazing. You want to know how I got married within six months, honey? Ask no more question and look no further. <laughs> so in today's video, I'll be sharing with you guys how to tighten your vagina. But this time, we are just going to use one ingredient and that will be cloves. Clove is an amazing ingredient. It has a lot of body benefits, especially for women. And this is what it looks like. Okay, it's just a spice. It's a spice that is used for making food and drinks and it is used a lot in asian and indian medicine it can also help you down there you best believe i don't give you something i have not tried it's the only ingredient you're going to need and i will be using it in this video now don't worry i will share the benefits of how to use it when to use it so watch this video till the end to get all the information girl every single thing and you are going to thank me in a few days when honey says oh la la good <laughs> so in this in this recipe i am using only two tablespoons of cloves and you can double your measurements according to your need but here i'll be using only two tablespoons okay so the next thing you want to do is to make sure that your cloves are clean this is what we're using for our body so we have to make sure that it is super super clean okay you can see from here that even though my cloves are clean i am still going to just rinse them again to just make sure that this is clean and i'm not gonna have any irritation or any funny stuff down there okay Okay, so what can these cloves do to your body? It contains anti-inflammatory, antifungal. In fact, it can also be used to treat cough, to treat mouth odor, digestion, and so many other things. But today we'll be focusing on things that it can do to the vagina, the cookie monster. First of all, all cloves are active in treating vaginal infection because we all know it possesses antioxidant, antifungal, anti um viral and even anti-diabetic properties and it can also fight um yeast infection so if you have yeast infection or itchiness down there or even you've been witnessing some discharge that is not your ovulation or pregnancy discharge then honey this recipe is for you so after rinsing your clothes the next thing to do is to transfer your clothes your clean clothes into a clean pot i have washed my pot so please make sure it is clean this is my measuring cup just to make sure that i measure the correct amount of water i'll be using this cup is one cup of water and i will be using it four times to make four cups of water another thing clove can do for your womanhood is to make it smell sweet ah, that is because it enhances the presence of fluid we all know that the absence of fluid during intercourse makes that place painful for a woman most especially and this can cause strain in your relationship so we don't want none of that this clove is capable of enhancing fluid in your womanhood and let it boil for at least 10 minutes now clove is also capable of tightening that area now believe me that area can be loose and trust me it's not because of you having a lot of intercourse there are many factors like childbirth age menopause even your mental health condition is also guilty but with cloves you can amend that area and continue your life so after boiling your clothes you want to let it cool down do not burn yourself please let it cool down before you proceed so this is my clothes water after cooling it down the next thing is going to do is to separate the water from the clothes next thing you want to do is to measure one cup which is 250 ml of this water remember we use four cups of water to boil the clothes and then we set the water back right it will be like three cups plus a little bit so you are going to use this daily measure Measure one cup and use it to rinse down there. I did not. I beg. I beg. I beg. I did not ask you to drink this water. I did not ask you to drink this clove water. You bath first and then you rinse with this clove water. And only using one cup. Don't rinse and then bath. I repeat. Don't.
don't rinse and then bath okay so after doing that you may notice some spiciness or just a tingling sensation it is normal just allow it to do its job and use this once a day for three to five days just allow it to do a job and use this once daily for three to five days and then what you do with the remaining cloves you can boil it again and use it if you are using it for five days you need to boil it so you can get more water because that clove is still useful so don't dispose of it yet you can reuse it again okay you can use it in the morning or at night but if you're using it twice a day you can only use it for three days if you're using it once a day then you can use it for five days please i repeat do not drink this water you only use it after you've taken a bath before you leave you just take one cup and you splash and honey let me let me be the first to tell you that after that day five when you lay <laughs> the rest is you